that was the contrast as back door goes. Wegman left wide open for a layup and a good feed from Utrecht. As she's able to fight it up into the air. Little the rebound. Out to Utrecht. Top of the key. Three on the way. Good from Utrecht. She's got seven. Wigman out to Little. Top of the key. Trying to get the ball down low to Utrecht. Utrecht spins around her defender. A wraparound layup is good from Casey Utrecht. A couple of passes. They go over the top to Little, but she is swarmed immediately. Kicked out to Terry. Three-pointer on the way. Good. Rattling home from Michaela Terry. It's been a slow third quarter, though, especially on this end of the floor. Utrecht from the elbow gets it to go. Well, that's a tough shot coming off the ball screen, being able to really get your feet set right, but Casey Utrecht was able to knock it down. She's got a game. Bird passes up a three, feeds it down low. Ball tipped, stolen away by Clark. Two on three. Terry will try to back it out. Little extra pass to Utrecht. Now Clark fading into the corner for three. Rattles home. Utrecht pulls up from about 10 feet. In, out, and then in. I don't think it hit the net, the net when it, it went through there. Already UIC eclipsing their point total from the first matchup when they lost 57 to 37. Utrecht down low, got fouled, and the roll. You have to give UIC credit. I mean, they've continued to fight and battle and claw their way back into this uh, basketball game. Speaks a lot to the character and the way they are coached. Down by 18 at half, they've got the lead down to seven. Still a lot of time left, too. And that's why head coach Cameron Whitaker called that timeout, but she gets a good drive to the basket and a left-handed layup from Wigman.